I might have this all messed up and out of line, man. I'm not too sure. Cause I'm I'm a one man band with putting this show together. I'm a one man band putting this show together. So I'm not even too sure, but yeah, we got the Celtics up first and we're gonna probably be talking about Jakari Harris first. Uh, I, I gotta check and see what video I got in the queue, man. Just excuse me. See on this. Yeah, Jakari Harris. I, I, I didn't I didn't trust my uh, memory. But the kid plays plays sessionally well this weekend. Very impressed with him, man. He handled the rock, he handled the rock good, passing the ball. But he, I think he a bona fide too. I mean, this kid's a bona fide too, and I know Purdue wants him real bad. That kid's a bona fide too to me, bona to fide too. He's really putting it on with the jump shot, taking it off dribble, doing all kind of things, and like this stuff. Like just really like light work, man. And like just like just light work. What are you doing? Court vision, all that. Got it going on, man. This kid had it going on this weekend. Shot, get to the goal. He got sneaky bounce. One thing about this game I really like about this game right now is he's seeing the floor better. That's one thing I like about him. He is seeing the floor better. Shot always bent there. But he's getting to the he's getting to the hole more. And he's seeing the floor better. That's what I like about this game. And he just, and he's getting real confident in what he's doing. And he went today. and he's looking to go to and one, but he, that's what I like you saw in that play. He didn't complain. He didn't complain at all about that, about getting bumped. And they didn't call it, but he was going the whole foy and one. As you can see, he got an and one on that. And how he just mixing up and changing his speeds right here. Didn't got to the goal on that with no, they didn't do no help. And then look at the play defense on the way, to, on the way back down court. Guy finished well around the rim, man. This kid just silky smooth. Silky, 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 silky smooth. Man, the kid is just silky smooth. I like what I see out of him, man. I, I want to make a nice little mix on him. He's on he's on the list of making a mix on. So we're gonna get this, we're gonna get him, get him going on. And then this other kid, Shikari, he look like a great pro though. I mean a great, he's gonna be a great college player but those the kids like he could be a pro i had two things in my head but Jaden williams when i'm talking about that's what I, that's what i got in my my head i was saying that Jaden williams look like he's gonna be a little nice little pro and i don't know why that there we go no 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 there we go i'm hitting the wrong thing man i got all these hitting these buttons and trying to think about what i'm talking about i apologize but Jaden williams about, I think he's about 6'10", kid, playing in the Carolina. They know Carolina, to be specifically. And he, man, I really like what I, I really like what I saw with, with him. Kid got a lot of better. I tried to get him on the show at the end in about July of last year. I still want the kid with the kid on the, on the show. Man, that kid is nice. He had his game on this display. And man, really, the big man, they stole the show. Because we're going to talk about another another big man, man coming up too. But they really stole the show, so man. Really stole the show. But this kid, he, he, he plays the new modern day style. How all these people are playing now. And you know how the bigs are playing out and they ain't playing five man out. And I'm gonna go ahead and play this video while I'm talking so you can see what I'm talking about. You just not uh, just not looking at me and see what I'm talking about. But look at he putting the ball on the floor now and about to take this dude off the dribble to the goal. And is it like roughly about 6'10? He doing this at 6'10. Doing this kind of things. So man, that's like Freaking ridiculous what he's doing and get off the floor so quick. You know, he a big, so he a two foot jumper, but he get off the floor quick. And he's playing smart and he knows, like he took that shot and he took his time because he knew he had to take, take his time because he know most bigs not used to guarding out there on the three point shot. So he took his time because he knew the guy ain't coming. If the guy came, he wanted a tip dunk that I wanted him to get that so bad because I was going to put that up that night. But he wanted the guy to come out here so he could take him off the dribble, like right now. He, he put a little smaller, a smaller big on him. 
and look what he's doing to him. He put him in the spin circle right there, doing the overhand, right-handed hook on him, and just playing. He's just playing with these people, man. He, he's the most skilled big man at the camp. He's just playing with these guys, man. He's just having his way with them and doing what he want to do. Playing defense, too, you know, like guarding that goal. That's what I like to see out of these kids when they're doing these kind of things. I love to see that these kids putting it together and stuff they're doing in the lab and they come out and display what they've been doing in the lab. And that's what, that's what is a beautiful thing doing that, man. This kid, he, any big he put on him, if he was quicker than them, he took him off the dribble. If he was bigger than them, he shot over them or posted them up. And hey man, around that basket, he is tanning it down. Around that basket, he is tanning it down. That's how I got to tan it down. And uh, I had to get a nod. He's he had a better weekend than Josh Hill, but I like this kid for over a year now, and I like his potential. Even I saw Josh Hill's potential, but really, I really love Josh Hill this weekend because how much he has to prove. This guy always been going up. Stock on the rise already, you know, stock bent going on the rise, but Josh Hill stock's going up. So I was like, I was more oppressed with Josh Hill because this guy right here, he always been doing good. And like I said, I wanted him on the show, join the show and play, you know, I mean, and just join the show and talk. I'm going to play. I'm listening to watching him play and talking about more than one thing at the same time and get me all confused what I'm talking about, man. But this kid right here. He's showing signs of a pro. This very high major right here. This kid is very, very, very high major, but showing signs of a pro. All right, it's, I like what I see out of this kid and the growth and development of this kid is, man, it's, it's, it's on point, man. It's really on point. And he see me in the gym recording them and stuff. He really don't know who I am. But when he see this podcast and how we put this together, he gonna understand what it, what we be doing when we in the gym putting it together and I'm showing this man. So Celtics, we want Jaden Williams on the show and Shikari, man, ask your DMs because I want you on the show talking about this footage we be putting up on you, man. We gotta have y'all on the show, man. We want to be completely out the line of sucks, man. We want the hometown teams on with a podcast based out of, man. We gotta have y'all on here, man.